So yips is just a term used to describe a jerk, a twitch, a freezing motion at the time of putting. In surveys of golfers, probably about 20 to 30 percent of golfers will describe that they've had a yip or a jerk. Usually it's in golfers who have played for many years, often in very good golfers, and usually on putts that are fairly short, so somewhere between 2 and 8 to 10 feet. We've been working on trying to identify a marker to say that somebody's neurologic versus psychologic. Right now what we use is our examinations. So when we see a patient or subject putting and we see the same sort of movement over and over again, when somebody's not even stressed, they'll still have a jerk or a twitch. That may be a reason or that may be an individual that we think is neurologic. Then we're looking at contractions of the muscles of the wrist flexors and extensors, which often fire at the same time. We're looking at rotation of the wrist, which seems to be much greater in the person, which we think has a neurologic cause. And then we're looking at how the putter moves, so the jerking or twitching of the putter at the time of impact. And all of those, we believe, can help us try to identify somebody with a neurologic cause as opposed to a psychologic cause or choking. So for people with a performance anxiety, I think that working with the golf pros and the uh, sports psychologists can be tremendously helpful. What I'm trying to do is identify the people who have a neurologic cause, and in those cases, uh, you just can't will it away. So with people with a neurologic cause, what we usually do is recommend changing grips much like people with writer's cramp will change how they hold a pen, same thing with musician's cramp, and then working with different oral medications, so pills may be helpful, and last but not least is the potential for botulinum toxin injections. Uh, that is not something that has been studied at this point in time, but we do use those to treat writer's cramp and musician's cramp, so there would be potential to treat people with golfer's cramp.